Environmental Impact Assessment is a major tool applied with the goal of making economic development projects environmentally sound and sustainable. It benefits the project in all aspects that there are misconceptions relating to the EIA, which we are going to list and clarify today. Misconception number one. Environment Impact Assessment Delays Project. If the environmental impact assessment is linked together from the planning, phase two screening and scoping phase, and detailed project report, combined with environment assessment done together, then it never delays project. It may even offset the possibility of delay by giving alternative analysis. Misconception number two. Environment impact assessment is just a add-on and does not have any worth. It is true. If the EIA starts late in the project cycle, but the true cost of the project to environment cannot be ignored, and it brings a balance between nature and the environment. It have different levels of mitigation as to avoid, reduce, compensate to protect the physical, biological, and socio-cultural environment. Misconception number three. Environment impact assessment is too expensive. Generally, Environment impact assessment cost falls within 1% of the total cost of the project. In fact, an EIA often saves costs by minimizing the number of changes needing to be made in later stages by identifying easier and more effective ways to meet project goals. Misconception number four. Environment impact assessment is too complex. Environment impact assessment is actually a simple process. Its potential impact may be complex sometimes and may be difficult to quantify. In such cases, investigation may be required as a part of planning process. Misconception number five. Environment impact assessment does not produce any useful result. In some cases, this is true due to poorly trained personnel or lack of focus towards goals to be achieved by EIA. EIA itself is not useless, but the depth of study, if done properly, will be a valuable tool for even the success of the project. Misconception number six. EIA will be misused in order to stop development. Although it is true that EIA has been misused in order to stop development, this does not invalidate the use of EIA. Instead, it indicates a problem with how it is coordinated. An EIA carried out properly is more likely to generate support for development to proceed than to prevent it. We need to understand these misconceptions in order to fully understand the importance of environmental study. Thanks for watching.